my stuff. My stuff. My stuff down there belongs to me. Come on. It's an enigma, you know, a mystery, huh? It's the one thing all men and women desire. It has built nations and destroyed empires. See, my stuff is something that I must protect. It's my essence, my universe that I cannot neglect. It's all powerful and commands much respect. Because that's my stuff that lives down there. It's the only stuff that can give birth to an heir. And it's not a prize to be won at some flippin' fair. Huh. And it's my choice if I want to share. Mm. My stuff is mine, and it comes with a price, you see. Because it's a piece of paradise that does not come for free. It's to be cherished. It's a beautiful part of me. It's the greatest treasure from sea to shining sea. Mm. My stuff is queen, this I know. For my clitoris tells me so. Huh. For the little man does not belong. The weak die out and I leave them strong. Huh. Okay. Why is my name always on your lips? You talk about me from my head to my toes to my fingertips. What is it about me that treats you so? What is it about me do you want to know? I'm not all that much different than you. I put on my shoes one at a time too. So tell me, is it the sway of my hips? that keeps my name on your lips? Is it because of the way I rise or because of the way I hold my head up high? Let me give you a little tip if you want to be like this chocolate chip. Huh? It's real bad business when you let your words slip. Hmm. They can come back to bite you like the sting from a whip. It's good to know that I'm always on your mind. Hmm. Such harsh words stop. You're being much too kind. So help me to understand your plan. Do you feel the need to be my PR man? Huh? You should always think twice before my name passes through your lips. Because you'll never know when the script gets flipped and your name is on someone else's lips. No one can tell you about me. Get it, girl. No one knows the things that I see. Huh? People assume because they're afraid to ask. I'm not some monster behind some mask. People don't know the things I've been through. I cry, I hurt, just like you do. Huh? She thinks she's all that, they say, when they hear me speak. But they didn't see me just last week when I struggled just to stay on my feet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm always standing tall, but just like you, I've got my flaws. Mm -hmm. Character defects, and I can count them all. Mm -hmm. While pointing at me, make sure you don't fall. Right. So judge me if you feel you must. I know who I am and that you can trust. No one can tell you about me. I can tell it better, you best believe. What would we be like if we were all the same? Would there be any assumptions or playing mind games? Right. For me, it's pretty clear to see. I'm proud of who I am, and I can tell you about me. Right. All right, now. Right, right, right. Okay, this is called When Love Isn't Enough. Love is mighty and can conquer all things through the good, the bad, and the in-between. It said you can love someone past their pain, but just as the sun comes up, here comes the pouring rain. How can I love you without losing me? When love isn't enough, don't you say, sorry. No. When love isn't, isn't enough to love them past their pain, when love isn't enough to get you through the hard times, the storms, the rain, do you continue to play this silly game? When in the end, it will drive you completely insane. Do you give up? Do you let go? Do you hold on even when you don't know what you're holding on to? But no one ever said love was fair. But when love isn't enough, why should you care? Right. When love isn't enough, you pay a great price. Because love is a gamble like the roll of the dice. Should you be the one to lose? Next time, be careful about who you choose. Mm -hmm. Love isn't enough. Right. 